troubleshooting. You'll notice on this connection that we have the regeneration inhibitor light flashing. We also have an active fault code indicated by the button. It is a Cummins ISB. So let's go to the DTC screen. Here you'll see the active fault code for the after treatment diesel particulate filter. Now you must make sure that you select the correct model in order to get the correct fault code. The model is located on a tag on the left side of the engine, on the front cover usually. Once the correct model is selected and you have Cummins Insight FIS installed, or whether Cummins Insight is registered or not, click on the code. Select Diagnostic Help. And through Cummins Insight, PF Diagnose will bring up the diagnostic troubleshooting tree. You simply follow the steps in the troubleshooting tree and effect the repairs. Again, the FIS system must be installed through Cummins Insight. But what if we don't have that? There is another program called DTC Solutions which is sold separately by Diesel Laptops and by Pocket Fleet Diagnostic Solutions. Diagnostic Trouble Code Solutions is a software package where you can look up the fault code for any particular engine that's listed. So here we'll select Cummins. We'll look for the best possible um, match and in this case Cummins All. And then we will look up the fault code 2369 And there it is, 2369, right? So we select the fault code. And here we'll have a list of the possible causes and the possible repairs. This is not a step-by-step -step, uh, feature as is Cummins FIS system, but it'll give you an idea of what could be causing the problem and what the possible repairs are. You can even print that and take it to the vehicle and read through it as you look for the fault, cause of the fault and effect the repairs. That's DTC Solutions from Diesel Laptops at www.diesellaptops.com and also available at www.pfdiagnose.com. Thank you.